You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. As the July 4th holiday approaches, many will be purchasing fireworks from vendors just like the one behind me. However, what some may not know is how dangerous these fireworks can be if mishandled. According to a Consumer Product Safety Commission study in 2020, over 15,000 people were admitted to the hospital for firework-related injuries. Wednesday, Mountaintop spoke with Pelfrey Fireworks Director of Operations, Sean Cottle, about firework safety. Fireworks uh, sure can be a lot of fun. Unfortunately, it can also be dangerous, so it's very important to make sure you utilize all the safety tips that we're getting ready to discuss with you here from the Jerry Pelfrey Firework Team. All right, so first of all, you want to make sure that you are purchasing your fireworks legally from a trusted source and a licensed retailer. Also, we wanna make sure when you are using the fireworks and igniting them that you do that in a clear, open, flat surface area. Also, you wanna make sure there's nothing obstructing the trajectory of the firework going up when you set it off. To safely light fireworks, it's recommended that audience members are at least 50 feet away from the ignition source. Pelfrey also recommends to keep a bucket of water or garden hose ready in case of a mishap. Okay, so you do not want to stand over a firework directly. When lighting it, you want to bend down, get to the side, light it, then step back and walk away quickly. As addressed by the Consumer Product Safety Commission, it's advised to never relight malfunctioning fireworks and to soak them in water before throwing them away. Other tips include letting fireworks complete their burning to prevent fires and to never point fireworks, including sparklers, at anyone. And lastly, the CPSC says to never let young children handle fireworks as they can reach temperatures of 2,000 degrees, enough to burn some metals. For more firework safety tips, you can visit cpsc.gov. Reporting from Johnson County, Kentucky, for Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Horgel.